okay welcome to engineering visualization channel okay now we are discussing problems on points here okay so it is one of the different type problem it is a combination of two points a and b okay so now we look at the question here a point a is 30 mm in front of vp and 40 mm above hp okay and it is uh, and another point b is 20 mm behind vp and 35 mm below hp the horizontal distance between the points measured parallel to xy line is 60 mm draw the three projections of the points okay three projections of the points means here both top view front view and side view okay join their front views and top views so we have to join both their top views and front views okay so now first i am going to draw on draw an xy line here So this is x this is y now first we take the point number a so point number a what the information is 30 mm in front of vp and 40 mm above hp okay 30 mm in front of vp and 40 mm above hp means it is the first quadrant so 30 mm in front of vp means so here we'll be constructing uh, 40 mm above hp means it is a front view okay front view i'm going to construct here Front view, we always got uh, above the xy line here. Okay. So, this is front view a dash. So, you can show the dimensions also. It is 40 and 30 mm in front of vp so in front of vp means it is the top view so top view we getting below the x line so 30 means three boxes okay and put a point this is your a is 30 so top and front view of the point a is done now point b is 20 mm behind vp behind vp 35 mm below hp below hp means it is the third quadrant here uh, behind of vp so behind of uh, vp means it is the top view so here the top view we are getting above the xy line here so so here before that you can see here they have given one information here the horizontal distance between the between the points measured parallel to x y line is 60 that means so in order to before uh, drawing the point number b we should draw a uh, consider a horizontal distance of 60 mm here okay here i'll mention with the dimension line okay this is 60 and here we have to construct so you can see 20 mm behind of vp behind of vp means it is the top view so top view in the third quadrant we are getting above the x y line so here so in this point is top view so this is b i am showing the dimension line this is 20 same way 35 mm below hp so below hp means it is a front view so in the front view in the third quadrant we are getting below the x y line so 35 means three and a half bucks you see this is one two three three and a half means till here we have to extend use the scale or the box no problem you will get the same length okay this point is b dash so this is done so both top views and front views are done and it is shown with a difference of at a horizontal distance of between the distance it is 60 mm that is also done now so the horizontal distance between the points measured parallel to x value is 60 draw the three projections of the three projection means you can see this is front view top view top and front view done now we have to draw the side view okay side view we have to construct so for this purpose what i'll do so we need to draw 45 degree angle line first for this uh, point a so the top view we are getting in the so this is our top view correct 
this is top view and this is front view so wherever we have the top view on that side we have to draw the 45 degree angle line okay so here i am i'll draw one x1 y1 line this is x1 and y1 i'll use the protractor here place it at the intersection of x1 and x1 y1 and mark for 45 degree and then draw an angle line okay now from this top view so draw the projection line till it touches the 45 degree line and then project it upward okay and then project has a projection line here also okay so this is the point where we get the side view a double dash you can see always with respect to the front view we will get, we'll get, get the side view here okay adjacent to it we'll get the side view okay in the same way now we have to construct the side view of this point b so you can see here the top view here this is the top view so top view here we're getting above the x y line that means we should construct the angle line so i'll take this as the reference only x1 y1 line i'll place the protector here and mark for 45 degree angle and then draw an angle line here okay and you can mention this angle here it is 45 degree now project the line that is projection line from this top view we have to draw remember it till it touches the 45 degree angle line and then project it downward till the b dash end okay till here and then project it from here also So this is our point, this is our side view, B double dash. Okay, this is our side view. So both the side views and the side views of both point A and point B it is done. Now join their front views and top views. So the front views, so front views, front view of A he is here and front view of B is here. So I'm going to join, join their front views and top views with a straight line. I'm going to do that. Okay, and then joining their top views also. okay so this completes the problem okay you can subscribe for the channel and hit on the bell icon for the latest notifications okay and share it to the maximum students so that they can be benefited thank you all thank you for watching the video